So folks, it's Craig again, and uh, we're talking about cuttings today. Um, the cooler weather is generally a good time to do them. Um, cuttings are really easy to do, they're free plants. So if you've got uh, friends that might have things like rosemary, sage, uh, lavender, um, this happens to be a pepino, get a hold of some. Use please clean sharp secateurs. When you're gonna make a cutting, you need to make sure that you cut just below a leaf node. Where the, where the leaves or stems join uh, that main stem and cut off the, the below leaves and snip off half or most of the leaves just like that. You reduce the tops of these down so that they're not having to supply as much water and uh, generally leave them uh, about you know three or four buds long. Um, don't push them in by themselves because what will happen is that you'll damage that cut that you've made where we're wanting this to callus over and, and, and uh, make root. So I use just a screwdriver, push it in after the hole's been made by the screwdriver, pack them in. You can get 30, 40, 50 cuttings in a little uh, pot like this. This has seed raising mix in it. You could use sand and uh, vermiculite mixed up, but look, seed raising mix seems to be a really easy thing, cheap and expensive to use. Again, don't use your own soil. It needs to hold more moisture um, you know, than, uh, than it would normally. So um, things like rosemary, very, very simple. Simply strip them off with your uh, thumb and forefinger and uh, again, pop them in with a dibble stick or your screwdriver. It, it doesn't take very long to get a lot of cuttings done in no time flat. What you do want to do is make sure that you're not taking stuff on hardwood cuttings and if you happen to have that's all you can get you can also use some hormone material you can get this in your local nursery it comes in powdered form or in um, in liquid form this happens to be liquid and this will actually help help the other uh, cutting to strike if it's you know starting to become a little hard in terms of the timber um, the real soft stuff that's you know really look is that nearly wilting that's nearly not good enough to take but you can take that that uh, thinner top off and get it down into the material that is sort of semi hardwood and uh, snip those leaves off again cut them back so that they're you know reducing the amount of moisture that they need and in you go so that's it water them in well and in around about uh, 10 to 12 weeks time you should start to see some roots coming out of the bottom of the pot. If not, just very carefully tip the pot over and allow the root ball to come out and just inspect it to see. Um, patience is a virtue sometimes when you're doing cuttings. It may take a bit longer, bide your time, but it's a great way of being able to grow new plants. Check out the My Smart Garden website for up and coming workshops. All the best.